20 years of legacy, 20 years of very fun, and 20 years of Midwest Fur Fest. Just recently, they've kickstarted their 20th iteration, and it is clear that things are going to get really big at the Furcom, which came along with some new things too, for example, the QR code registration, which the Furcom claims to allow for a faster registration process. Our US correspondent Amar Wolf was covering the Furcon, and this is what we are hearing from him with our big fluffy ear so far. During MFF's opening ceremony, they've honored staff members who had been with the Furcon for 20 years. Thank you very much. They are there are around more than 300 dealers at a dealer's den. There were a total of United States dollars 42,000 worth of art sold during this year's art show. They've donated a total of United States dollars 110,156 dollars to their charity partner Felines and Canines. Felines and Canines, excuse me. And to add even more icing on the cake, it is doubled to a grand total of United States dollars 221 thousand nine hundred and twelve dollars thanks to an anonymous donor making this the mff's largest amount ever donated lastly they have a total of more than eleven thousand attendees at the furcon more coverage on mff can be found on our news website at pause31808.wixsite.com slash gftv news Malaysian Free Convention First Upon Malaysia recently has announced that for the first time, they will be holding a charity auction at the Furcon in conjunction with their charity partner, Katzen Cat Sanctuary. It will be where various items are auctioned off to the highest bidder, with all proceedings wholly going to the charity partner. The auction had the following terms. Each auction increment are in a minimum of 5 Malaysian Ringgits. The auction's winner must honour the bid amount. Full payment must be made in only Malaysian Ringgit immediately to Katzen via cash or to their PayPal after winning the bid. No negotiation of bid amount is available and there will be no returns on items won. The convention will start this upcoming weekend from the 14th to 15th December, so stay tuned to our coverage as an exclusive live broadcast under our Furcon coverage program GFTV Furcon Special at Forum 2019. Broadcast schedules will be released soon.